Hi, beloved. In the Lord, my name is A. Melody. This is Heavenly Host Vision with Lady. I'm so glad to welcome you to yet another prophetic word. May the Almighty God bless you and keep you safe, sound, and protected. Listen, right now, your peace is returning. Calmness has been restored because the east wind blew and washed away all those things around you that were troubling you. The east wind blew and shattered and destroyed all those who were troubling you. The east wind blew and actually made sure that balance is restored in your life. Glory be to God. All those things that didn't have, all those things that had 40 foundations have been dealt with. They've all been taken away. And now you will have a clearer vision of what you're supposed to do. You are actually, um, your decisions are, you know, clearer right now. The things that you're thinking about are actually coming to fruition. The, your atmosphere is cleared right now, beloved. Your atmosphere is cleared right now. In the name of our Lord and Savior Christ Jesus. A lot of things have been shattered. Things that were destroyed have been shattered. By the east wind. Because those things around you didn't have, they didn't have, genuine intention towards you they're not contributing contributing to to create a better life for you those things that have not served your highest good have all fallen off they have all fallen off people things situations have all given ways for you to actually navigate to your destiny glory be to god Matthew, let's uh, Matthew, uh, some verse 26 to 24 to 27. I beg your pardon. Everyone who hears this word of mine and does not act on them will be like a foolish man who built his house on the sand, and the, and the rain fall, and the floods come, and the wind blew and slammed against that house, and it fell, and great was its fall. Some people have not heard God's voice in your life. They've not done things correctly. Even though you were warning them, talking to them, they kept on taking your word for granted. God has tested their works and they were found wanting. And as I'm talking to you, a lot of people have been destroyed. People have been destroyed because they refused to hear God's words from you. They refused to actually obey God's voice. Even when God spoke to them one-on-one, -on -one, they refused. They, they, they thought that you know, they could just do whatever that they wanted and not actually making sure that they are, that they are grounded and that they, they, that they, 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 they focus on things that matter. Because they were like kind of being carried by every wind of doctrine, by all the options that were coming towards them or by all the flattery things that were coming towards them. Now God tested their works. God tested your works and they were found wanting and were all being crushed. We're all being crushed. Some people are going through situation right now because they built their hopes, their visions, their careers, their families on faulty foundations. And the Lord is saying that you were standing and standing really, really strong because you were really following up what God was saying, even in the midst of the time that the east wind was blowing. There's been a moment that the east wind was blowing. Everyone felt this. Even you, you felt this. But because you, because your trust was in God, because you were building things on solid foundation, you, you stood. You stood, beloved. The wind came and blew, but you stood. You could not fall because your foundation is solid. Your foundation is solid. God has destroyed all 40 foundations. That's why peace is returning to you. Peace is returning to you. Glory be to God. Hallelujah. Hosea's, um, Hosea 13, verse 15. Though the flourishes among the, 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 the reeds, an east wind will come. The wind of the Lord coming up from the wilderness. And his fountain will, be, uh, will become dry. And his spring will be, be dried up. It will, it will plunder his treasure of every precious article. Now, like I said, the east wind was seriously blowing. 
few months ago, few weeks ago, few days ago, it was not easy. And works were being tested. And because some of these works were being on were, were established on Fort Foundation, the East Wing, even though they felt it felt as though the, the works were flourishing, it felt as though, as though things were going on well. It seemed, it seemed as though some people were doing great things. It seemed as though things were moving up well. But beloved, beneath that was a faulty foundation and the east wind like the lord is saying that east wind has destroyed some foundations some things have crumbled some people have, have, have are lamenting right now because of what they, what they are going through some situations have actually backfired beloved because of this judgment that god sent using the east wind to test works to bring things to light to test foundations but you came out victorious, beloved, hallelujah. You came out successfully because your foundation is sure. You were being carried like you were being, it felt like you, you, almost, you, in fact, you almost gave up because of the stress, the tension, the anxiety that you were going through. Some of you were going through so much internal battle, internal conflict, outward conflict. Those were the, the tests, in that, those were all tests. Hallelujah. The East Wind was testing you, bringing all, all the internal and, and, and external conflicts to see if you're going to crumble or not. But you stood and still standing. You're still standing. Hallelujah. The East Wind tested and you, you, and, and, and you could not fall. You are still standing because your foundation is solid. Your foundation is solid. And for those who have been building on faulty foundations, they are lamenting right now because Things have shattered. God has slammed doors on some people. God has shattered some things and it came crumbling on some people. Some situations have all gone and now your peace has returned to you. Peace has returned to you. Peace has returned to you. Be sure, beloved, I feel peace in the spirit. I feel a change of atmosphere in the spirit. And I know that you know what I'm talking about. God bless you so much and continue to give you in perfect peace in the name of our Lord and Savior, Yahushua Mashiach. Faith is our vehicle of our strength. See you in the next video.